We added Alexander Hamilton into the Mary Powell exhibit, which was from 2020. And we added this in because this had just became 50 years since its last sale in, uh, back, back then. Uh, and in, in making this exhibit here, we didn't, re didn't really think too much about it. But then we had another side of the wall, which we had to fill in, which was part of our fishing exhibit. And we decided to uh, add in this skin we have here of a sturgeon, which we've had for years. Now we've added this in. This is actually up in the barn in a cardboard box for years. So I brought it down and when, where I used to work, I've done this before to insert, insert them into like styrofoam and then make it look like the, the fish had died and this was the bottom of this, the water, you know, sand and all. And then embed it into that to look like it's a natural thing. This is actually the original skin off a of sturgeon. If you look at a photograph of the sturgeon here, you see the tail, you see the head. The tail, this would have been cut off here. The head would have been cut off there. If you look at this and estimate it, this fish actually would have been about seven feet, seven and a half feet tall. Because the head would have come to here and his tail would have been down past the floor. In doing that, we had extra wall space. So we added in invasive species, native species, and then we've also then relocated our shared fishing to our shared boat, which is over here on the other side. And this part explains shared fishing from way back when, all the way up until the graph shows it here in the 1990s when they stopped shared fishing because they got overfished. And right now you still can't fish for them. This is on Tucker Beach in Port Ewan. There was the fishing camp where they would dry out the nets and untangle them and then fix all the nets and all. When fish, shed fishing was an abundant thing to do.